Should I get an Infinity Q50 or should I get a Q60? What year should I also get? I'm gonna say get an Infinity Q60. Uh, everybody has a Q50. The Q60's body lines look amazing and the resale value on the Q60 is actually higher than the Q50. So yeah, definitely get a Q60. And honestly, it doesn't really matter what year you get. They all have problems, just get a warranty. That's the most simplest way I could possibly give it to you. Because if you get a 2024, you're getting ripped off. If you get a 2022, it's not bad. Um, just get it with a warranty. Because no, no matter what year you have, it has been shown and seen on these groups and forums that these cars do have problems regardless of what year you have. So you might just want to get a warranty so you don't have to bite the bullet in case something comes up, especially if you decide to finance this car. Honestly, I wouldn't really recommend this car if this is your only car. If you don't have warranty, don't get this car if this is your only car, if, you don't have, if you're not planning on getting warranty. Or you have like a potluck of money on the side that you're looking to like blow. These cars are very reliable, don't get me wrong. But they're more suited for a certain type of person, a certain type of demographic. Like... Regardless of the warranty thing, if this is your second car and you don't want to have warranty, okay, but you can't have this car without warranty or a second car. You got to either choose this or that because things will break and it is not a very cheap car to like fix. Like if, if $5,000 and $10,000 is a cheap repair bill to you, then okay, but by any means, this isn't a cheap car. Just letting you know what you're getting into before you get into it.